Kamadeka Show. I'm Joe Wamba, joined with Eric Kamadeka, head coach of the indoor track and field teams. And, Coach, you know, we talked last week about the MAC meet that you guys went and competed in this past weekend. I don't know if we were expecting <laughs> this, this type of performance. Yeah, it was pretty crazy, uh, just from a team pers- standpoint as well as individuals. The individuals really st- stood up this year. Uh, you know, we went from scoring 15 points on the women's side to scoring 100 this year. Uh, going one through four in the weight throw to begin the meet for the women, and then the men's DMR team winning the DMR, setting a meet record was just a great start to the meet. I think those meet records coming out of the bat were just the way to make this statement. You know, we're here and we're competing. And you told us uh, before we started recording, six was it five guys in the 60 meter dash yeah, made five, the final meet. Five guys made it. We had lined up five guys in the prelims. All five made it through to the finals. We ended up going one, three, five, and I think seven, eight. Devonte ran out of his mind this weekend. You know, setting the meet record in that, putting himself number ten, I believe, in the country in the sixty. So he'll most likely qualify for nationals in that event. Then he followed up in the two hundred, held off the guy from Misericordia to set a huge meet PR, um, put himself number two in the country on that list. So we're expecting some big things coming out of him. Um, but the other guys followed up too. You know, we went I think five and seven in that as well. It's just incredible. It seems like every week we're talking, you know, there's personal records being set and then meet records being set, school records being set. What does that do in terms of motivation or preparation, getting in ready for the ECAC meet this weekend? Part of the whole recruiting pitch was when I first got here was we want to make ourselves a national caliber program and being able to do stuff like this really shows that these kids are buying in and that we're getting that level. Um, Going to ECACs, you know, if we really went after ECACs, we're giving some people a weekend off and some break, but, you know, there's a chance that we could win ECACs as well. So this is showing the, the improvement of our program. And a lot of, you know, uh, maybe not so much expectations to win events in the Nationals in the coming weeks, but at least be, you know, top finishers. Yeah, absolutely. You know, we we don't want to put that pressure out there. They kind of know what they want to do right now. We know what they want them to do and what they're capable of doing. But, you know, hopefully Devontae becomes an All-American two events. Danica, she goes out there, throws like she's capable of doing. She could be an All-American as well. And, you know, again, that puts us on the map. It absolutely does. All Americans or just being at the Nationals and at ECACs and finishing well does a lot for the program in terms of recruitment and retention. Absolutely. And, you know, this is going to be the first time a woman's ever qualified for a national meet um, this year or for the program, as well as the first time that I've ever had athletes qualify for indoor nationals. So it's just really, really great for the program and very exciting for everyone. And it's a couple way, a couple of weeks away, but the outdoor portion of the season, you know, is right around the corner. What does indoor, you know, the finishes that we've been having in indoor track and field do for, uh, you know, expectations of outdoor? Yeah, you know, we want to carry the momentum that we have from this indoor season. Uh, We also need to give them a little bit of a break. So after nationals, some people are going to have, or even going to nationals, everyone who's not going there is going to get a little bit of time off Mm -hmm. to kind of rest, recuperate. But we want to pick back up. Uh, Some of us will be competing on March 19th. And again, right out the gate, we want to hit some of those Matt qualifying standards and without trying you know hopefully just go out there and compete and hit those ECAC qualifying standards well coach we wish you the best of luck and congratulations and all those awesome finishes Thanks. at the Mac meet he's Eric Kamadeka I'm Joe Wamba and this has been the Eric Kamadeka show